right, welcome back. It's 2009. Um, it's good to see you guys again. This is uh, The Other Side's weekly video update. I'm glad you guys joined us. My name is Jeff. Uh, I'm Sarah. This is Sarah, and today we have Lauren with us. We're doing the video blog in 09, a little different than we've done in 08. We're going to have a chance to talk to Lauren a little bit about who she is and uh, kind of what she likes, dislikes, uh, walks on the beach, pina coladas, that sort of thing. <laughs> um, but no, just get to know Lauren a little bit more. Um, highlight a student every week is going to be our goal in 2009. And, um, and then we're going to talk a little bit about announcements and then give you the favorite part of the video blog, question, question of the of week. The week. Um, so I hope you enjoy the new format. Uh, all criticisms can go to Sarah at TLC.org. Um, that's O-R-G and Sarah with an H. Um, all right, so I'll start. So we want to get to know Lauren. I want you all to get to know her. So Lauren, tell us a little bit about yourself. Um, do you go to college? Yeah, I go to Cabrillo College right across the street. Um, right now I'm taking a winter session class and I've been going for about two years. Two years. And what do you like most about Cabrillo? Oh, it's pretty close to home and also I can schedule my classes the way I like it and uh, really cheap too and I get tons of scholarships. Nice. Yeah. What do you like least about Cabrillo? Uh, <laughs> probably winter session. <laughs> like, I like the Probably idea of having, today. Yeah, I like the idea of having you know an extra class you can take so it's not your classes aren't too piled up in fall. Um, mm -hmm. But they're pretty intense. Mine was like three and a half hours, four days a week, and my midterm is next week. Okay, and what time do you have to get up in the morning to go to your winter session class? Seven thirty. Boo, boo. Yeah. I mean, yay education! But you do get to ride a cool scooter on the way. That's true. We need to. You need to ask her about Lauren, that. Lauren. Uh, yeah, Lauren, I, I have a chance to work with Lauren um, in my other job outside of this. We work at we used to work at a, a photo studio together, so I, um, Lauren's a good friend, but um, she would ride a scooter to work and have, how, tell me a little bit about how many problems <laughs> and how many times you've had the scooter in the garage yes. over the past like it's, three months. I wheeled it to the garage last night, and they're still <laughs> working on it. It's like... Um, well, we actually well, we broke it actually. We broke the little the little, one of the magnets, so we had to replace oh, it. Geez. But now, it's in the shop for a different reason too. <laughs> so it's costing wow. about half of what I paid for it, <laughs> and it's always in and out of the shop. But when I do when it do work when it does work, it's pretty cool. Yeah. Nice. All right, so. We're back, and the biggest announcement that we have is something you guys have probably heard of. It is the other side snow blast. Woo! So exciting. All right, the snow blast is when we take a bunch of you up to Tahoe, and it's going to be amazing. It's February 2nd to the 5th, and we're going to leave here at 2 p.m. on February 5th, and we're going to be here in the parking lot. And we're going to be back Sunday, February 8th, at around 5 p.m. And we're going to be staying at a cabin in South Lake Tahoe. And we're going to be skiing or snowboarding at Sierra at Tahoe. And it's going to be so much fun. And we really want you guys to come. So here's the deal. It costs $80 to, to go on this trip. But you need to <laughs> um, you need to bring in your th it costs we need to okay thirty five dollars is your deposit <laughs> okay we need your thirty five dollars or leave <laughs> can you guys please bring it this Wednesday because we can only take 20 of you and there's like 25 people signed up so the first 20 people to get us their 35 deposit in reserves their spot and then we just see the other $45 before we <laughs> Even if you don't want to ski or snowboard, 
We're just gonna play in the snow, snowball fight, snow angels, make snowmen, maybe dig some tunnels. It's gonna be great. South Shore, all that good stuff. So, sign up for the snow blast, turn your deposit in, and yes. Child Steve. So there's Steve! Hi, Ty. Oh, Haiti. Haiti. And our goal is for him to have to donate about one dollar a month. Um, one dollar a week. One dollar a week, sorry. And uh, for each each college student to us member. Um, and he just turned four. Oh and his birthday was a few days ago, so we hope you can raise some money and help him out. So bring a dollar Thank you very much. Wednesday. I would just like to remind everybody that it's 70 degrees out today. <laughs> I am sweating so much right now. You better appreciate this. Uh, <laughs> um, so, uh, oh, hold on. So we have this new series we're talking about. It's called 99 and One, and uh, what we're what we're essentially talking about is evangelism, but through a story, because Jesus liked to use a lot of stories of sheep and how it was more important for the shepherd to go after the one than to um, than to take care of the 99 who were safe already. So we're going to be looking at that story and, and what it means for evangelism, what evangelism looks like in Santa Cruz County, um, and how we can be effectively talking to our friends and family about uh, the love of Christ. And so Sarah's going to be talking this week, um, and she's going to be kind of introducing the idea of evangelism and talking about what it means to be an evangelist or to evangelize, and, and really uh, like how we can transfer that, that story and that idea that seems so backwards to us to go after the 99, or to go after the one mm -hmm. when um, there are 99 there already. Um, so, uh, we'll be talking about that this coming, this coming week. Uh, it should be fun. Bring your Bibles. And we are going to end this lovely video blog, the first one of 09, um, with, of course, Question of the Week. And where do they leave Question of the Week? Down in the response section on our MySpace page. It would be lovely to um, check those out and see Yay. what you guys have said. So. This question is... What is your favorite snow activity? Because Jeff is in his snow garb and we're talking about the snow blast trip coming up. What do you enjoy doing most in the snow? So leave your comments down in the comment section and we'll look forward to reading what you guys say. That's it! Woo! Lauren, thanks for coming! Thanks for being here. Jeff, thanks for being here! Messing up! This is ridiculous. That was the most fun I think I've ever had in my life. I was trying right. to do a straight face. Couldn't do it. Couldn't do it. Alright, we love you guys. We'll see you Wednesday. See you Wednesday. Bye. <laughs> that I have, and then I can put a fleece on under this, or like um, put another layer on top of this. What's that? Turn into summer. Yeah. It's uh.